a shortwave radio. It's amazing how small these things have become in the last 10 years. doing there I was taking your case for safekeeping since it was left here unattended when I picked it up the cover unlatched I never leave my violin unattended ah then no one else could have put this purse in your case um someone must have snuck it in like you aha uh -huh, for sure and you have a pistol in the case because I don't owe you an explanation it's mine I have a gun license. Now, take the damned purse to the Baroness and leave me in peace. Did the... Here's something. What are you doing? I'm trying to make what I suspect are fingerprints visible. Found anything? Unfortunately, no. There are only a couple of fingerprints on the window. It was probably clean before departure, but the prints I can see look like glove marks. Well, wouldn't you expect that? What professional burglar wouldn't wear gloves? Which makes me wonder what a professional burglar would hope to find in your compartment. I don't have anything to say to that. I thought as much. <coughs> Is everyone all right? Are you hurt? Quick thinking. Well done, Zellner. <coughs> I think the tunnel collapsed. Then he's trapped. Hurry, we have to lock the second exit. Sir, there's a fire up ahead. The engine's burning. It's a distraction. Hurry, block the exit. But, sir... <coughs> the fire will consume all the oxygen. I expect the rum will burn like ethanol, but I'd better not test that theory in the bottle. I'm the god of fire. Matt, where are you? Oh. Matt, are you there? I uncoupled the locomotive at full speed. Not bad, eh? Do you think we'll get in trouble? Because of the locomotive? I don't think so. It was pretty old already. Come out, so we can have a chat. I checked the entire train. There's no one on it except for us. What an adventure. Oh, yeah. Tell me, what did you see on the train? 
Well, it was like this. I wanted to get my pistol. It would be best if no one found out about this. There's some blood and hair stuck to the pipe. Hair I really can't afford to lose. The door frame was damaged when Dr. Gebhardt kicked it in. The real question is, why was the door locked in the first place? Hmm. Assuming the murderer isn't a magician, and the Baroness locked the door herself before she went to bed, the murderer couldn't have left the cabin through the door. So, the murderer must have still been in here when Dr. Gebhardt kicked the door in. Which is unlikely, because someone would have seen him. Or he found another way out of the cabin. I need the second bullet for a comparison. All right. That's the proof. Whoever shot the Baroness also fired the shot in the cargo hold. What could that mean? Time to pay Legrand a visit. <gasps> no! I congratulate you on your triumph, but no one will confine the raven to a cage. There is but one way out, and that is by my own hand. Farewell, raven hunter, R. Inspector Legrand!
These exhibits aren't originals, of course. They're reconstructed, based on old pictures. Nonetheless, it's impressive how they managed to build monuments like the pyramids with such simple tools. if I'm not mistaken. Why don't you step into the light? Mr. Inch. Amazing. Truly amazing. I thought young Legrand would be my most dangerous opponent, but it seems I should have had more respect for age. And the bomb on the train? Did you want to kill us all? I knew that Legrand would be hot on my heels after the heist in London. He's a dangerous man, Mr. Zellner. He almost caught me once. Is that a reason to resort to murder? God, I barely look like myself. I'm not as good as the Raven at slipping into other roles. He's had decades to perfect it. There's still some coffee left. Coffee for the gentleman. Do you know what the problem with people like you is? Um, you mean our lack of a sense of duty, or our skin color, or a lack of respect for our elders? <laughs> we have so many flaws. chance. Steady as a rock. <laughs> Elegant. to be frightened, young lady. What are you doing here? I wanted to see you. This is hardly the time or the place. What happened on the train? Nothing, nothing bad. Everyone is fine. Inch is dangerous. We warned you. I know. That's why we're being careful. And you have a smart and handsome young thief at your side. And humble, too. Don't worry. I'll take care of you. What have I done to deserve a luck like this? The strap. Aha. Hmm. Nefertiti Guernica, AD Buonarotti's Adam. This could be a memory aid for the Baroness, and it would explain how Inch discovered the combination. 
Okay. The coat of arms of New York City is on the poster. There's the obligatory eagle. That can't be it, since there's no eagle on the lock. But look here. How cute. There are two beavers posing on the New York City emblem. Guernica equals New York equals beaver. All four symbols decoded. Gosh, I'm good. Now, I need to get back to the Baroness's cabin. The jewel is waiting for me. I have to do the dirty work for you in the museum, so you won't be shooting me or him. Very well. You win. What? Oh, never speak to me like that again. Do you understand? I need you to steal the eye, but one day I could be overwhelmed by a feeling of hatred that will make me forget the eye. Black in here. Here we go. I think it's nothing. Now or never. He wants to lock me in. But why? He doesn't have the jewel yet. What is he? Oh, no. He's up there, Robert. I know it. Maybe. Go to the guardroom and open the gates. <laughs> Good dog. 